I'm gonna pick one of these PlayStation 5 dual charging stations up. They're $30. Best Buy has been out sold out for a long time, so grab one of these since they're in stock. Definitely uh, makes it a lot easier charging controllers. We got Madden 22. I wish Kickstand's ass in Madden, so our first PS5 game. I just got to the uh, Plainfield Pike flea market. Unfortunately, I got to work at uh, 7 a.m., so it, it is like 8 o'clock right now. So we are like an hour later than we usually want to be. Um, but Kobe and Stan are on their way. They're going to meet me here. Uh, then after Plainfield, we'll go to Seacock. Um, the weather right now, as you see, is pretty sunny out. Um, it's kind of chilly. It is sunny, but at least it's not raining out. So uh, that's one positive. But, oh, yeah, we get anything cool, I'll show you back at my house. What we got? Sound the Hedgehog. That dude's You're not getting a slip. There's not a slip available in the world. In the world, it flowered it too. And my friend just came back from Florida. There's not a slip. There's no slips. We should have brought a jacket or something. No, what do you do? It's a little oh, chilly. Oh, yeah. Stick it up your ass. You better make sure Mad you Mad Dog McCree? I had a sailboat. I bought a sailboat when I was in the first boat. What if it's just that way? It's like, oh, I didn't know I was shit. I got to put it in the water. I got to dig it out of the water. I got to winterize it. I got to have a slip for it. Anything else? So I learned my lesson. So then my kid was like 10 years old. He's like, Dad, I can't deal with this. Sailboat shit. Mm. Yeah, no, it's not I don't think there's really much here to be honest. Nobody keeps stopping and drive by the driveway. Is it for sale? I only go in two days. It's my boat. Nobody keeps wanting to know if it's for sale. Oh, you get, listen, that's very, 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 very. No, this is the same stuff we've seen the last few weeks. So. Thank you. Oh, you got a poker mm. blackjack. Good luck with your poker. Yeah, um, let's see. I do four for all three. That's fair. Hmm? That's a good deal. Uh, get you a bag. Stay one of these. Uh, bad company. They got Star Wars trilogy and Skyrim. Right. See if I have any of these. Dude, they got the uh. A little dirty, but they're like the special edition blue one. So how much are your remotes? Uh, Ten bucks for all of them. Okay. Dude, that's definitely the thumbnail to the video, bro. Your nose is the biggest Stan's nose, dude. <laughs> you gotta pick that up. You gotta pick that up. <laughs> that's dope. You gotta buy it. That's like that's a five dollar piece of that. That's funny as hell. Mission Impossible. What are you talking about? The, the, the bin that we were just looking at earlier. Yeah. Of the um, Sega Genesis games. That's pretty cool. I already have those. In, I already have all those games, unfortunately. Hey, anytime. Just bring them. See what they got, Sam. Anything good? Anything good? They got that famous Rugby 06, dude. Ooh. The PAL version. Interesting. International cricket. Damn. Yeah, All right. Cricket in 2005. <laughs> two dollars a piece. Okay. You guys at Shores right now? You at Shores right now? <laughs> I think I have those. I'm gonna pick those up. So I'm over at Whole Foods right now. Yeah. It's better. It is better. Definitely a lot better. Wait, you're gonna fly. Yeah. I'm gonna make more money. Tony Hawk board. Tony Hawk ride game. Oh, let's go check that out in a sec. Go check it out, see if you want to get it. Yeah, I know he would own but come in his pants. How much your uh, games, guys? I'm not sure. It all depends on the price, so. Are they all priced the same or? Yeah, they're all priced the same. Like four, four or five bucks. Four or five bucks, okay.
Cool. You guys, want any? Uh, I see what I think. I have some of them. I'm not sure. Let me check. We try. We try to be, you know, as fair as price, and you know, work on stuff, and you know, build up customers. Wait, looking for this. Uh, this F Zero box. Oh, uh, F Zero. I was doing eighty. On eighty. Yeah, it's a good game. Trilogy is How much for these games you're looking for? Um, Bartman, I can go 25. 25, on. okay. Uh, River City Ransom is 35. 35. Which is about 10 on there. Uh, I'll do. I already have this too. I'm looking yeah. for this one. Oh, Bill and Ted? I can do 15 on Bill and Ted. 15 on Bill and Ted? Okay, cool. Yeah, it's about a ship size. 20? Okay. Like, That's pretty good price. So. I guess I try and keep it fair, try to keep it under you. Though. Yeah. That's a double pack for five. Those are all five bucks. Play five bucks a piece? Okay. Yeah, it's backwards compatible. They're a little bit off random. Backwards compatible. Because the SP can even do it. Yeah. But that's a problem. I used to play Pokemon. Is a guy making me up to have so much video? I had to cut out all the stuff. Can I make two? You guys, you guys are good enough to know, like, mainly the prices off the top of your head. Yeah. 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 I was gonna say anybody, anybody who walks up and sees that and yeah, knows the value of the stuff is gonna know that. Okay, yeah. this one's hitting for five more. Like there's some things that. where like I'm just, I'm shocked yeah. by it, you know what I mean? But I know, yeah, yeah. I know the general. I try, I try and leave like these are all extra ends of lots. I've already like double triple down and I just put them in the bin. You know, they're just, yeah. just sitting. So I'm just like, okay, why not? I don't know if Halo 4. Yeah, the, the Activision Anthology, I think, goes one. for like 15. They have it for Xbox One as well. You do? Yeah. Find all those? Or? Yeah, there, there's, no, some, oh, no. there's some games oh, that like we really to don't expect to be worth anything. We'll pick yeah. up. Uh, there was a Harry Potter game that we picked yeah. up. Yeah. Yeah, it's worth like 50, 60 bucks. Yeah, we, yeah for some reason. I have no idea we why. Had no idea. We were just, just like Harry Potter. Before, like, like, really? Some games. Exactly. Crash and burn. Anything, anything exclusive? You see, let me know. I'm really into Virginia Trilogy. Assassin's Creed Three for the uh, PS3. Ezio. Yeah. Uh, three was Ezio, right? No, uh, Brotherhood is. I thought. Or is he in both of them? Yeah. In three as well. Yeah. Oh, okay. he is in both. All right, cool. Yeah, because four was. There's no doubt. Any of the games here are two bucks on the NCAA. Okay. All right, cool. Arkham City. I might. Yeah, I'm gonna see what I want and then. I gotta tell people. Window down. Uh, for one and two. Nice pickup. Sealed, too. nice. Barker Avenger. Never played that. No, I never played that one. I uh, wanted for the Xbox, it? so you got like a tree branch and you got like beat people to tree branch. It's yeah. really goofy. And they get Taz, yeah. it's pretty cool. I don't know. I think I might get the Barney, Where's Carmen, and Mag. So. How about you, Colby? Anything? No, I couldn't find any. Alright, cool. Yeah. Any one of these down? I know they're sports games, but some filler. Here's the Pokemon. Why don't you throw it the Pokemon? Right. Oh, yeah. If you get lucky, you can find that cheap. Yeah. I'm looking for Booker. Game with like. Few games, I, but like, I got one for, those or no? one with a few games. Smart for yeah. Me, but. yeah, I don't have enough on Alright, cool. Alright, so another week of game hunting um, in the books. So, pretty good week. Uh, Plainfield and Seekonk, they weren't uh, fabulous with the, the overall quality of the games. We did get a lot of games. Uh, and then, I'm, last week went to Best Buy, and I got some pretty good stuff. I'll just show you for the PlayStation 5. I got this DualSense charging station. Um, basically, it's just a charging dock. It looks like a mini PS5. Put a controllers on it. And um, it charges it without actually attaching to the PS5, so you don't have to leave your PS5 in uh, the rest mode. So that was pretty cool. This was, I think, $30 or $40. Then I also picked up my first PS5 game. I've had my PS5 since uh, January. I haven't bought any games before. I got Madden 22. Unfortunately, this was a $70 game. Uh, in my opinion, that is, that's kind of expensive. Um, it's, it's just a basically yeah. roster upgrade. Uh, but me and Stan, we, we always play Madden. We always play like 19 or 20 because that's what we find at you know the flea markets. You know, usually the previous game or maybe even two games. But yeah, I'm gonna kick his ass in this game right after this video. Um, it's gonna be a drubbing, so I'm pretty excited about that. Uh, get to beat his ass in 4K. So, 
And then on Sunday, we went to, uh, like I said, Plainfield Pike and Seekonk. Um, what did you get at uh, Plainfield Pike there, Colby? Uh, Tony Hawk Shredboard? Shred? Yeah. Yeah. Uh, no sensor, but $3. Pretty Why not? Deal. Yeah, that's a good deal on that. Pick up. And that's for the PS3? PS3, yeah. PS3. Oh, that's pretty dope. Yeah. You didn't get anything, right? No, Plainfield not that playing field. Um, I did get a, a couple of things. So uh, the first pickup I got was um, just these three random games. I got Dirt 3, it is complete. Bad Company, it is complete again. And then I also got Skyrim, which is also complete. Uh, they were $2 a piece. So anytime any 360 games or just any games are $2 a piece, I'll, I'll was, pick them up. Uh, was that at the booth where they said two for five? And then... <laughs> No, that, that's a different booth. <laughs> Those ladies are not there this week. Thank God, they can't do math, dude. Uh, this is guy we always get games off of. Uh, he always hooks it up with the price, so I got that. Uh, and then, this is in uh, the first row, which, you know, when you go to the flea market a lot, you kind of like know where to go, like where all the games are. And this was in the first row, which is really never games. Uh, they're $2 a piece, so I got Halo 3, which surprisingly I, I didn't have. Uh, Tom Clancy's End War, and these games are all complete. Fallout 3. Halo 3 ODST. So good. I, what's the difference between them? It's just like a different campaign. Oh, okay. It still is heavy. Is this oh, there's two discs yeah, in there. That's pretty, pretty interesting. I never, actually never heard of that before. Yeah. Um, NBA 2002 Inside Drive. That's a good game. Uh, this is with uh, Vince Carter. And the only reason I picked it up because once again, it's a uh, Xbox exclusive. I think I picked up 03 last week. So I got both of those. I don't know if there's any more or not. Uh, DJ Hero 2 for the PS3. And then prototype for PlayStation 3. Another great game if you haven't played it. Yeah. I've heard good things about it. I just never mm -hmm. really played it before. It's been out for a long time too, so maybe if I I don't have a lot of time. I got we got so many games. It's kinda of hard to like pick. Because at this point I feel like we're being more of hoarders <laughs> sometimes. But I try my best to play the games. I just I, I really don't have all that time. Uh then the last one we went to at uh Plainfield Pike, I got uh Twisted Metal Black. Um, pretty good game. I have this already, but I have the red label one, so uh, I like to get the black label. And I also got a uh, Star Wars 2 Trilogy for the original Xbox. I think I actually mixed one of these up. I think I got one of the other games with at that booth, but did you? Anyway, they're all two dollars a piece of games, so it doesn't really matter about where I got them. Yeah, about. what they originally said uh, five dollars a piece yeah, $5 too. Five dollars a piece. <laughs> they're like, no, yeah, no. no. And I got them two for five. I got Dirt 3 with this game, actually, that's what it was, Dirt 3, um, but 2 for 5 or $2, it's kind of the same thing, just 50 cents more. Um, and then we went to uh, Seekonk, and it really wasn't a lot. Uh, what did you get at Seekonk? So, they, uh, what was the deal that they had in that bin? Oh, it was uh, four, four, uh, four for, 5 for 20. 5 for 20. Yeah. So, I picked up Taz, Escape from Mars. Um, I don't really have many Genesis games. No, you don't. You only like five um, or six of them. I, we don't really see them that often. And, I and when we do, they're, they're sports games. No. So I don't really... Yeah, no. I'm not going to get the sports games for Genesis. Um, and then Xbox One, they had Battlefront 1 and 2. So 2 is actually still sealed. Oh, is it really? Yeah. yeah. Oh, that's pretty good. So I thought that was a good deal on that. And then I had never heard of Far Cry Vengeance. Um, I brought it up to you guys, what you said I that you it. had heard I of it. Have it yeah. um, I'm a big Far Cry fan, but I, I did not know only, about this. I didn't know they had a like a Wii version. I played it so. once. You, you kind of use the motion controls. Um, so if you don't like motion controls, it's kind of gimmicky. But once you get used to the controls, it's actually pretty fun. Uh, you didn't get anything at Seacom, did you? Uh, San Andreas. Oh, you did get San Andreas. Where yeah. is it? Uh, not bad. I mean, it's a almost complete. Came with the map. A dollar. A dollar. You, can't, you really can't beat a dollar game. No. no. That game Especially San Andreas. Yeah, it's a classic. I like that it really comes with, like, it has the poster still. Yeah. Yeah. Like, that's a that's a hard find. Yeah, a lot to of times. find them the still with the poster. Missing. Remember when it's I used like, to go to GameStop and I used to put the posters, bro? I used to go to GameStop and pre order a game that I was never going to buy to get the poster, mm -hmm. and then I would cancel my pre order the next day. <laughs> And get, is that get why is that how I had back. all those posters? That's how I had all yeah, those like, posters. Like every game poster. I used to yeah, put five dollars kind of, down, <laughs> get the poster, or get any like action figure or something that came for the game when you pre-order, and then I would cancel the pre-order next day. Didn't uh, Overwatch? Overwatch came with like a little Winston. Yep, and I got that. Yep, dude. But I actually did buy Overwatch. Great yeah, game. Yeah. I never, I never thought about doing that. I actually pretty good idea. 
And then at Seacock, I got a couple of uh, gems here. Then the best one here is definitely Barney's Hide and Seek. Um, we're gonna be playing that later. We're sure. gonna be playing that later. Um, you know, it looks pretty interesting. <laughs> so, you know, I I don't know why I even got these games. To be honest, they weren't really. It wasn't a bad deal on those. It wasn't the best deal in the world. I did I did kind of pay what they're worth. It was just the first time I bought from those guys, and you know, they were fans of the channel. So I wanted to help them out, get that relationship going on. But I think I got Barney. I got a Jungle Strike, and then this one I I didn't have this game, so I didn't mind paying five dollars for. Is uh, Where in Time is Carmen Santiago? Is that what it is? Or? Yeah. I've never heard of it. Basically, it's a Where's Waldo game. So, and hopefully, we do see those guys again soon. They said that they were opening up a store. Yeah, in uh, um, Cranston, in Cranston, not too far from Time Capsule too. So it's like, when when we go to Time Capsule, we can always make a stop right over there. They give us their card. In the next video, I'll show it. Um, but like I said, yeah, once they open, we'll definitely get some footage of uh, mm -hmm. going there. Can you yeah, I wasn't really sure where I got the controllers, so I'll just mention them. You got now. them at Playfield. I got Plainfield. Right, yep. I paid five dollars for these, and uh, I usually don't buy controllers because I, I have a lot of them. Um, but these are pretty cool colors. So I got the ice blue original Xbox controller. Which I never see that. I've never seen these before. Um, the sticks are in okay shape. There's a little a little chunk right in here, but you know, uh, these controllers are like twenty five bucks a pop. So for five dollars, it's a pretty good deal. I also got a fourth controller, but that was a uh, third party. That controller was really junk. So I threw it away. Got the ice blue, and I got the, the Halo green, basically. Uh, there's two variants of this controller, which I have both of them. So I have the Halo Special Edition Xbox, and then they have the same exact color controller. The only thing that's different is this Halo here instead of uh, Xbox. But um, these controllers are, once again, like 25 bucks a piece. So I'm going to probably put these on display with my Xbox. And then it's part of the bundle, so I just picked up a regular original Xbox S controller. And this one's, um, the sticks are okay. It's a little bent right there, but... I don't think I only have two other Xbox controllers, so I tried to put these in just in case anybody wants to come over and play them. He uh, gave a great deal because he didn't have a bag. And yeah. He didn't have a bag. He, he, wanted, have a bag. he wanted $10 for all of them, but then I talked about the five. He's like, oh, all right. I'm like, oh, I need a bag, dude. I'm like, I'm going to carry this around. I should probably bring a backpack. We probably should do that. We yeah. always buy stuff, but I just, I just always forget. So, yeah, that's all, that's all we got, right? Anything, yeah. anything else? No, I... I think this is, I mean, we didn't do too bad considering that there wasn't as many people there. Yeah. Um, so I would say for the amount that we got, not bad at all. On Thursday, um, hopefully you can go if you have time, but me, Colby, and Justin from True Retro Gaming are going to go out. Uh, I think I'm going to trade in some extra systems I have on action in television. Uh, Stan got me in television last year for my birthday, and I got that complete in box one, so I'm going to just trade one in time capsule along with a PlayStation 2. Uh, I'm thinking I could probably get like at least sixty dollars in store credit. I hope that's part. Of, that's part of my goal. So mm -hmm. if I get that, I'll be pretty happy. And then we'll get some more games. So well with them, and then uh, Saturday I can't go to the yard sales because I'm working. And then Sunday we'll go to the flea market. So yeah. um, anything cool? Uh, like I said, we'll make another video next week. So uh, thanks for watching, guys. Please like, subscribe, and have a good one. Thank you.